So friends, I've got the Chiffonier uh, Larkin dresser here laid out on the floor and I basically got a four-way glue job coming up here concurrently. These uh, brackets and tracks are busted up or they've come out of their uh, groove. So I'm coming in here with the Elmer's Carpenter's glue and I've also got to replace this busted up piece right here butting those two, gluing those two ends. It's gonna be like this, having to fit those in the tongue and groove joints here as well. Shoring and gluing up this part of the dresser has come out very well. Actually, better than anticipated. It took quite a bit of uh, pushing and a little bit of light pounding this way and downward as this was all lifted up as well. And this corner here, all four of these uh, pieces were separated in one way or another and that's seated really nicely tongue and grooves firmly in place this piece has been secured back onto here and those other pit places you saw previously have all been shored up as well so I will let this set overnight good morning next day friends and the glue job has come out really nice particularly down in this corner here that was all busted up and that's what you saw me doing in the previous clip. And that piece down there is well secured as well as that guy was out. And this thing is just really rugged and squared up now. And the last order of business is to put back the drawers with the beautiful shiny. So this is a clump of beeswax. And I'm just going to run down these runners like a sleigh. And same thing inside here in that groove. And just make sure this is well lubricated with beeswax. And I'm going to do this to all of the areas that's making friction with those drawers. Through the decades, all the gunk that was on these handles, and now, man, they're just so clean. That's really nice to be able to just grab a clean handle pull on there. Part of the reason why I do this stuff and finish it up is to bring it back to life and enjoy its beauty and natural splendor. Look at this. This was part of the reason when this thing I saw was being offered for free in the neighborhood in an online posting, I could not pass it up, man. That and the, I think this is called serpentine. That um, cantilevered, cantilevered design there. Is that called serpentine? I think so. Well, here it is, friends. All done. Really nice. A couple of the drawers were or are a little snug, but man, it really is working out beautifully. This thing is all squared up. I marked with tape the order of the drawers because they only go in one way. And I mean, there's a couple touch-ups that I'll have to do. This drawer is a little sticky, but hey, again, 1905. This big board down here, big drawer down here, I had to do some really extensive repair. But man, this can ro roll around and it's just a beautiful antique item. Thanks for coming along for this project. This has been one of my favorite uh, street find restores. Actually, this was a freebie giveaway, a neighborhood giveaway. Um, but anyway, subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos on doing these types of projects reclaiming antiques, restoring them, because they were just heading for the landfill. So, beautiful Larkin Chiffonier, made in Buffalo, New York, circa 1900, 1905, and uh, it's really been a lot of fun. Thanks.